Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to install mods in BeamNG Drive using two different methods. First we'll go over the easiest method using the in-game mod manager. Then I'll show you how to install mods from a third party website which gives you access to a much wider variety of mods. Let's jump right in. For the first method it's super simple. You just go to the home page on BeamNG Drive. Then you go to respiratory. There's many mods to choose from here, many pages. You can search for pretty much anything. Let's just say we want this ETK. You just click subscribe, wait for it to download. It's as easy as that. And you just go back, and then you can play it in free roam. And it's super simple, you just load it in like any other car. All right, let's get into the second method. Alrighty guys, and for the second method, super simple you can get so many different mods in real life cars so you're going to want to go down to your browser open that up and then in your search bar you want to put in modland you're going to want to look for modland.net it should be the first thing that comes up then under games you're going to want to find bmng drive you want to click that here you will see there are a ton of mods listed so many high quality mods of real life cars and let's just say we want a BMW so we're going to search for that in the search bar and I like this one so a bunch of pictures here you're going to want to scroll down and find the download links here so let's say we want this one so you're going to want to click modifier open to external site that is fine then it'll bring you to modsfire.com. You're going to want to click generate link. It'll take a few se seconds to generate it. And you're going to want to click generate or download link again. And then you're going to want to click the download button. If it opens a new tab, just close it out. That's fine. And just click it again. And it is going to start our download. This will take anywhere from a few seconds to a couple minutes depending on how big the file is. Alright, and then when this is done downloading, you're going to want to close out of your browser and then I'll show you what to do. Alrighty, and when you finish downloading, you just close your browser and then you relaunch Beam and G Drive. Alright, when you launch Beam and G Drive, you're going to want to come down to Respiratory, where the first method was. You're going to want to go over to Mod Manager. You're going to want to go to Open Mod Folder. When you open this, it'll open the Mod Folder. You're going to want to click the New Tab button. You're going to want to go to Downloads. And then you see you should have the mod you downloaded. Mine is the BMW that we downloaded. You're going to click on this, drag this over to Mods, then put it over here, and I'm going to copy it to Mods. Alright, with that, it is so simple. Just like that, you're done. You just want to kind of close this folder, then reopen BeamNG Drive. And then you can see here it's in our mod folder. You want to go back, go to Free Roam, and then go to any map you would like. Alrighty, guys, and when you spawn in, you're going to want to go to Escape, then you want to go to Vehicles, where you usually change a different vehicle. And then in here, you should find your mod that you recently downloaded. There's many mods. This is a real life car. It's highly detailed. There's just so many different versions of this. Alright guys, just like that, we have our mod from Modland. It is super high quality, a real life car. So yeah guys, thank you for watching, I really appreciate it if you dropped a follow, and we'll see you on the next vid video.